Today, I am sharing my realistic homeschool mom morning routine, and I'll also be hosting a giveaway for Yield Wooden Watches. I chose the Purple Heart and Plum watch from the Frankie series and absolutely love it. I am excited to be given more opportunities to give back to you mamas who love and support me so well, and even more excited to know that one of you will win $100 off free sizing and shipping of any Yield watch of choice. For now, let's get into this morning routine. So I know, I know, I wake up pretty late, but I am a night owl, so I need that extra sleep in the morning. After I send a few morning messages to my favorites, I start my day by making my bed, pretty much always. It's kind of a habit I've always had, but got intensified once I got married. True story, when Brian and I first got married, I woke up one morning, I got out of bed and went to the bathroom. When I came back, my bed was already made. Yes, it's that serious around here. Like I said, I'm the night owl, but my kids are the early birds. They're normally out in the living room watching their cartoons and waiting for me to get started with my day. <laughs> So I let them hang out and then I head back to my room. I light a candle and I give myself a couple minutes to put on a little makeup and lay out my clothes for the day. Savannah is the baby, so she tends to sleep in a little bit later than the boys do. Around this time is when she wakes up and she comes and she wants all the mommy hugs and kisses and she sees I'm filming, so there's that. Next, I head into the kitchen to start on some breakfast. By now, the boys have probably had a bowl of cereal and now I'm just going to make some eggs for all of us and maybe a little bit of raisin toast. It's time for mommy to get dressed, so I head back to my room again. I'm excited to put on my watch today. I am not a huge jewelry person, but I am such a sucker for things that are personalized and have meaning and help me through my days. The winner of this giveaway will receive $100 off free sizing and shipping of any Yield watch of your choice, but I was also given a code for $25 off that's valid during the course of this giveaway. Oh my goodness, you guys. I had mine engraved with the phrase, use your superpowers, and that's just a huge reminder to me of the scripture 2 Corinthians 12 and 9, which is huge in my motherhood. It tells me that his grace is sufficient, that his power is made perfect in my weaknesses. I believe that motherhood is my superpower because it's a place of lots of weaknesses for me, but where I am weak, he is strong. This is my absolute favorite part on top of an already insanely gorgeous watch. I'm really thankful to Yode Watches for sending over this watch for me, including an opportunity to extend a giveaway to all of you. We don't have to be perfect, and there is strength in our weaknesses, and I think that's the best thing that I ever learned. Okay, so I'm all ready for the day put together I'm excited <laughs> I probably still wear my PJs once a week but um, I have been doing a good job getting dressed in the morning and it has been making all the difference especially with filming videos and getting all of my other stuff done for our businesses so um, I just have on this super comfy kind of stretchy top shirt from um, cotton on that's like a pale pinkish purplish blush color which I like a lot and then I have this sweater super cozy sweater with pockets which is the best thing ever um, I got this last year from Target and then I have on my Levi's super stretchy of course I put on my necklace that has our, our wedding date is on there and my yod watch which i think looks so cute but i'm still super comfy because i'm just going to be 
um, hanging out with the kids all day, reading, getting our work done. Maybe we'll go for a walk. So it's not overdone, just enough. Normally my toenails are not painted, so, <laughs> but today they happen to be. And I normally just walk around barefoot because that's how I like to be. But I do also like to wear my little fuzzy slippers. I think I picked up on the clearance section. Yeah. I'm pretty sure they were from Target. Now I'm gonna have my breakfast. I'm just gonna chop up some peppers, add a little fresh um, onions and avocado to my eggs that don't look appealing because of this light, but they are super yummy. I have some time left in my morning, so the kids are going to start working on their morning baskets. Then I'm gonna head out here to my studio space, which is in my garage, if you guys have followed for a while. So I'm gonna head out here and get some work done. Um, I have some orders, look my forward is gone, but I have some orders that I need to um, get prepared for the kids to pack. I also have some editing to do and I wanted to try and film a home decor haul for our new living room makeover, so I'm probably going to do that. A lot of people ask me, you know, how did it all begin for you? Did you want to become a scientist? And I was so lucky in my mother because she supported my love, my fascination for animals. So instead of getting mad at me, Ugh, throw those dirty things out, she very quietly said, Jane, they need the earth or they'll die. And we took them back into the garden. But what she said to me, she said, you know, you were looking so intently at those earthworms, as though you were wondering how do they move without legs. After I finish my brunch and a quick 15-20 minute lesson for myself, it's time to do Savannah's hair and respond to any messages that I sent from the morning. How was your day, Grammy? We miss you. And then we get started with our homeschool day. Now, today is a little different. I am pretty much behind because I spent my time filming this morning routine. So don't judge me, okay? <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I had a lot of fun making it. Please don't forget to enter the giveaway by commenting down below. What is your favorite part of your homeschool morning routine? Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in our next video. Bye.